With her finger on the trigger and her eyes on the target, Elena Stockton says she's working on her personal safety outside the gun range. So this is a six bedroom house. Stockton is a real estate agent. An additional mother-in-law apartment in the basement. She wants to make a sale. Additional living space. But more importantly, she wants to stay safe. You can't rely on law enforcement. They can't be everywhere all the time. To help keep her protected, Stockton's brokerage recently gave her these safety tips. Make sure that if you were to escape by the back door, you could escape from the backyard. And while she appreciates the advice, Stockton is now taking matters into her own hands. By the way of a nine millimeter. Yeah, I like both of those. Stockton is practicing shooting a handgun. It seems heavy. So she can eventually carry it to her open houses. What impact does training have on your career now and your safety in your career? I think training honestly is the most important thing. It does give you a sense of safety, you know, in being not just in real estate, but in being in public. We're learning more women like Stockton are getting their concealed carry permits. In a recent study, the Crime Prevention Research Center found that between 2012 and 2018, the number of women in the United States with concealed carry permits increased by 207%. You want something that's going to have what? Stopping power. And hall points are not going to just try and go through you. They're going to go through all of you. At the Guns for Everyone gun shop, they're holding a concealed carry class specifically for women. Make sure there's no space. Yeah, right there. These women studying to get their concealed carry permits say they're motivated by everything from mass shootings to personal safety. I've been in those situations. I don't want to feel like I can't do something. Even if something bad happens to me, I want to know that I tried to do something and I was able to at least try to help. The owner of this gun shop, Edgar Antayun, you can in fact carry there, says these women-only classes are growing in popularity with a 30% increase in just the past few weeks. Recent events that, that have happened, El Paso, uh, Ohio, a lot of people want to defend themselves. A lot of people sometimes get too lazy and complacent and wait till the last minute. And unfortunately, it takes an event like that to, to kind of push people over the edge to, to get the proper training. So more women are getting more guns. And put that underneath a trigger guard. But does that make them more safe? Point in a safe direction. Our only safe direction is downrange. Antayun says if you pull a gun, you better be ready to use it. If not, well, you could have it used against you. You need to know whether or not you, you have the mental uh, capability of using uh, this firearm. I'm Kai Beach reporting.